what was the concept of British liberty, and why did Americans claim that the British were trying to enslave them? The concept of British liberty was critical to political thought, both among leaders and ordinary people on both sides of the Atlantic in the 18th century. It was widely accepted, both in Britain and in the colonies, that Britain was a unique home of liberty. British liberty meant limits on the power of the government after the great struggles of the uh, 17th century. It, uh, a system had pretty much solidified, which was a limited monarchy. You had a monarchy, but with great power in parliament to check the power of the king. You had what they called a balanced constitution with all the different parts balancing each other, and therefore none could become oppressive. The rights of Englishmen were well respected, trial by jury, habeas corpus, just a rule of law that it, in contrast to France or Spain, absolute monarchies, in England it was the rule of law. Every citizen was protected by the law. The king could not act in a highly arbitrary manner. And that was considered the basis of freedom. It's certainly in its political manifestation. Um, now, of course, the very term British liberty was not an accidental term. It was for British people. It didn't apply to Spanish. It didn't apply to Catholics, by and large. It certainly didn't apply to Africans. At the same time that they are glorifying British liberty, they are bringing millions of Africans in British ships to be slaves in the New World. But that was no contradiction, they said. That they're not British. They don't, they're not entitled to British liberty. This is only a parochial, it's a parochial idea for a particular people, and other people are sort of outside of it. But for those within the boundary of freedom, they certainly felt that they were the freest people on earth.